It's a snapshot of the health of, of each community. The Robert Wood Johnson Foundation and University of Wisconsin Population Health Institutes released county-by-county county health rankings. These rankings are determined by outcomes or the longevity of people and a variety of factors that can influence health, including health behaviors, social and economic factors, and the physical environment. We're equally concerned about each of those counties trying to uh, assure that the health status of those counties is as high as it can be. Hughes says one of those factors in health status is tied to poverty levels. There's considerable data out there that shows that uh, higher poverty levels tend to have lower health status or lower health outcomes um, versus individuals that tend to um, not be in poverty tend to have a tend to have a better health status, better health outcome. Crawford, Roscommon, and Clare counties all rank as some of the unhealthiest counties in the state. Lawanda North runs a food bank in Roscommon County and sees firsthand how hundreds of families' overall health is affected. When you're hungry and you don't have a lot of money, you always don't make the best choices. You know, there's a lot of junk food out there for cheap and people tend to go for that, what they can buy most for their dollar. So what's the solution in building healthier communities? It's very, very important to have buy-in from the people who are making decisions because we're looking at changing the entire environment of a community. The old saying, it takes a village to raise a child, you know, I firmly believe that. We're all in this together, we're all in this world. If we don't help each other, where are we going to be in 10 years, 20 years? In Wexford County, Charlie Lapastora, ABC 29 and 8.